Hey everyone, Shannon here. Um, I haven't done a video in so many weeks. It's been so hectic here. Uh, my boyfriend got in a car accident, so we've been trying to find another car. We got a new vehicle. We got a 2015 Toyota Tacoma, which is great. We upgraded from Tiny Scion. Um, we had family in town. My baby got sick. I am just getting over a cold. Uh, we went to the Hot Sauce Festival in Long Beach, which was awesome. Um, but because of the car accident, it kind of set us back a little bit. So I always, we were only able to just buy two sauces from one booth that we, that we enjoyed. And we enjoyed talking to the people. They were pretty cool. Um, but I just decided to do a update or a, um, a review on a hot sauce that I said I was going to do a couple weeks ago. Um, it's or like a month ago or two months ago. It's been in my pantry and I've been wanting to open it and try it on some food, but I wanted to open it for you guys. Um, this is Oaked Arrogant Bastard Ale. Someone else did a review on this that I'm just going to include on the bottom. Um, and uh, you could go ahead and click it and they probably have a better review than me because I suck at these, but I enjoy doing them. Um, it says, Oak Arrogant Bastard Ale is a truly unique beer. All the aggressive palate pun punishing flavor of the original Arrogant Bastard Ale but with the American oak wood chips added in the brewing process resulting in unique flavors and aromas of vanilla and molasses. Combining it with the roasty distinctiveness of chipotle peppers creates a hot sauce as unique as the beer. Um, so we'll go ahead and try it. And uh, personally, I am a ale person. I like ales, not a big fan of IPA. Ugh. Uh, all right. Anyway, so when I was at the hot sauce festival, I tried sriracha beer. It's pretty cool. It was good, but it tastes like uh, the Mexican drinks, like those uh, Bud Light or Budweiser ones with the tomato juice of the chiladas. Almost identical. It tastes almost exactly like that. I mean, if you could put them like side to side comparison, I'm, there's probably a little difference. Probably with the sriracha, it kind of tastes more garlic, but. For a beer, it's pretty good. Okay, while well, I'm shaking this, it sounds really watery. And you can even see it's a watery, watery hot sauce. You can smell the smokiness. Mmm, it smells like camping or Texas, like a Texas barbecue. I used to go to Texas all the time when I was a kid. Okay. My mouth is watering. It smells good. Alright. It's a really liquidy consistency. Now, I know it doesn't always look like a lot. I got a bitch mouth, so, alright, down the hatch. really good. It tastes like barbecue sauce. It tastes like a hot sauce barbecue sauce. Sauce hot barbecue. <laughs> and that's what it tastes like. It's really good. It's really sweet. I'll put this on ribs. I mean, I wish they actually made a bigger version of this because then you could like douse it like it's uh, barbecue sauce. So you could probably mix it with some barbecue sauce. It tastes really smoky. It's not that hot at all. Not hot at all. It's super sweet, super smoky. Um, the consistency is a little grainy. Um, I could taste like, when it was going down. You could, you could feel the peppers. They didn't grind it up completely with the peppers. You could see them floating in here. I don't even know if you could be able to see it, but there's pepper flakes, and uh, it's pretty good. Um, also, I'll be doing another garden update soon. We have. Our garden is just not doing as good as it was last year, but there was there's a lot of tomatoes. Oh, let me see if I oh, these are what we got. We got eggplant, which I love eggplant. I'm Turkish and we cook a lot of eggplant. Lots of tomatoes, a squash, this is how big it got. The plant actually died. But there was a really big oh, there was a really big storm that came through and so uh 
I think a lot of our plants just got way too much water. So our, our garden is not doing as good as it was this year. It, the, the season here is so bipolar. It's hot and cold, hot and cold, hot and cold. Um, but uh, yeah, we got Caribbean hots, with our, the, which are the scotch bonnet peppers. And we have scorpion peppers out there. We just got some fatale peppers. We got a whole bunch of peppers. Um, our ghost pepper plant's not doing good, but I'm hoping towards the end of the season it'll pick back up. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll do another one of those, and then I'll do some more hot sauce updates later in the week. Thanks!